Right, what genre do you think the film is? Um, I'd say it's sort of crime and violence. Yeah. Yeah. Like, um, neo noir, sort of the like, um, I don't know, battle between what's good and what's bad. Yeah, sort of like um, Devil on Angel on each shoulder and things like that. Yeah. Testing moral boundaries. Definitely. Yeah. Yeah, I get that. What features represent that it's a trailer? It's got um, like lots of different um, aspects of the movie in just like a shortened down sort of version. Yeah. So you, you see yeah. a wide range of characters all in a really short space of time. Yeah. So it's quite obvious, and the editing is quite like cut to one place to yeah. another. Yeah. It's very really fast editing. Yeah. Yeah, definitely. <clears throat> lots of like different different key key points within the film put together. So. And a clear narrative as well. Mm -hmm. Um, what do you think about the characters in the trailer? Do you understand who they are and what their part is in the film? Well, there was this one character, I don't know his name because it wasn't mentioned, but he told the main character to be safe. Like, I couldn't really yeah. tell like, what his purpose was, if he was a good or a bad guy, if he had like split opinions. I wasn't yeah. really sure. That, that, yeah, I don't think that was yeah. to me very clear. And also the, the girl in it, she's, like, she's quite a strong um, actor and character. Yeah, I don't think her sort of part was played on enough. Yeah, um, I wasn't, like, it was obvious she was significant, but it wasn't yeah, obvious by her why much, or like she, why, yeah. or anything like that. I thought the main character that was in the police outfit was good, they were like a strong character, mm -hmm. um, and you could tell that they were the main character because they appeared throughout. Yeah. yeah and definitely. what, going back to him, so his name is uh, Ross <laughs> in the film, do you understand what's going on? Like, what, what is happening to him? Um, is, he is, he going, is he going undercover? Yeah. So, um, like, trying to, like, um, infiltrate um, this crime or, or gang, yeah. something like that, a drug ring. Um, the, the first part of his child, I thought that was, like, his motive to sort of go off. Well, like, that's yeah. what led him that way. Yeah. I think that was quite clear from the trailer. Like, that was the storyline. Yeah. What, um, what was the point that you picked that up on, that that child was amazing? Well, when when the, la the other lady came to like knock on the door, yeah. he seemed like the way he was like, right, I need to tell you this. It's almost mm -hmm. like he's doing something like really big and really significant. And his um, kid and obviously was must have been a lot. A shot of the letter saying that he's lost custody. And I think that that's when <coughs> I was really, like, made it really clear. Yeah, that potentially yeah. like things could go downhill because he's got like nothing left. Yeah, that's so. why because he'd obviously lost everything. What do you think are the main themes in the film that are shown in the trailer? Well, um, as in like there's a lot of violence or like crime or just any any themes that you pick up on. Uh, okay, so there's, there's like sort of the cross between good and bad. Yeah, like what's wrong and what's right. What's, because obviously you got from that that he left the. Thing, but he didn't know why, but you mm. knew he had left it because maybe something bad happened. Yeah. So it was sort of like a realisation of how he was. Yeah. Sort of and like you don't know why things. when he was reading the letter, you don't know like why yeah, his why kids taken yeah. away. So that family aspect of it mm -hmm. um, could like, you could really like play on that because obviously some people or the audience might be able to relate to that. Yeah. Like difficult family times. So you were saying crime, violence, uncertainty, yeah, family. family. Yeah. Um, yeah, moral boundaries. Issues. Yeah, moral yeah. boundaries. So, what do you think the main plot is? So, what is the narrative? What's happening in this trailer? Um, well, I think what we can see is that it starts off with kind of the equilibrium being disrupted, where like he's getting his kid taken away, or not being able to see his kid anymore. Um, and then it's kind of just builds on there, him getting into maybe the bad side and also trying to help resolve that and then kind of come across different violence and different events that may you know. He went for like quite, it seemed like quite a moral path, like he made like good and bad decisions and like by the end of it he it was quite, I felt like he already knew that he had made a bad decision so he left the entire thing which is yeah. why there was conflict at the end. Yeah and a lot, I think a lot of it is to do with like um, even though it is a job and he's got to, he's got to go undercover, I think a lot of it is to do with him as an actual person, like following his journey rather than like yeah. his journey um, in relation to the job. It's his journey from like where like losing um, custody and then sort of to the end, like where he ends up. Because I can imagine him ending up like I don't know living on the streets or something. 
So you so, think it is, it's not focusing on the job, you feel that he gets too involved in his job and that's yeah, part like, of the yeah. 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 Like, yeah, I think he, he puts later. his whole like focus into being at work because he sort of lost everything else around yeah. him. So he just um, channels everything. And aside from that, do you pick up on the love aspect of it, the romantic? Yeah, uh, between, between the, the female. Yeah. Uh, what What are you picking? What are you getting from the trailer? I feel like she's um, maybe represents sort of like the bad side of it, the way she was smoking and everything. Maybe that's like um, also I don't know could like signify how he's going down like a really bad path. Um, yeah. And but I also see that she's sort of like. A strong character because like yeah. it sort of shows that like with the smoke and stuff that's like quite like strong like, yeah, yeah not not powerful but, but like authoritative like the way yeah. she was standing and everything yeah and everything like that so she was quite authoritative like I'd assume she was on like the bad side of things um so would you go and watch this film if you've seen this trailer um and if you wouldn't give me a reading and if you will give me a reading um I think I would it's quite exciting um and lots of action was shown um, and I think that it's kind of film I'd like. Mm, no, I'd really like to see it because I think I just want to, like I said, it's just I want to know like where he ends up right at the end um, and how like I want to also know like how he got in that position of losing his kid because mm. um, that obviously I don't know you haven't really explained it whether that's good or bad. Um, but I just want to know like why Hawaii has ended up in such a situation. I just want to find out like about like, I'd go and see it because there's all of the other like sub characters. I want to find out like what their purpose is because you only see them for a little bit of time. Like, I want to see how they all live together and things like that. Mm -hmm. So I'd definitely go watch it because of that. What are your favourite moments in the trailer? Not as in because I didn't want to watch it. <laughs> I only got to the end, thank God. Um, as in, I just love the way you did it. Like that was really good, really, yeah. really good. Yeah. Uh, the titling was so good. Like, yeah. That's sort of more from a media perspective, but it just really like it was really creative. Definitely. Like, Definitely. I like the whole story as well. I thought that it was kind of, especially the fast paced like, editing bits. It kind of was really exciting. Mm -hmm. The part when you saw like all the different characters, I should be like a gang. Yeah. Like doing like you saw all of them individually as they were like working yeah and i thought that was quite interesting i thought yeah. that was like it showed you all the characters work but it didn't show you their purpose i thought that was quite yeah. and i think you did a voiceover at one point um when they were like in the suits and i like that because sometimes it can take a lot longer to, for someone to like explain who this person is mm -hmm. but i think a voiceover just helped just to get to the point yeah um, to let the audience know this is all you need to know at the moment, but more will be revealed. And it didn't, yeah, it didn't leave me too confused that I was like, I wouldn't want to go see it because it's, it's too yeah. much, but like, it was like the right amount for me to be intrigued, but still have yeah. enough sense to go and want to find out. Yeah. Um, and final question, what elements do you think we can improve in terms of everything, so sound or clips or...? There was this one part with the sound, when it, I think it was what, but you couldn't really hear it because the music was too loud. Like it sort of clashed because one was a lot faster than the other, and you couldn't really hear what they were saying. What part was that? I think it was a bit where he was like muttering something. Yeah. To, like. Do you want me to in the bedroom? Like, yeah. yeah, when, yeah. He, when he's doing work, or some form of work. Yeah. Mm. It's just after he's. You hear you hear him really well when he's in the bathroom and he's like in his face like why am I doing this? But then it sort of mutters out and you don't hear it as well, and it just you have to properly listen to hear it. But, oh yeah, no, Rory's bit, I think he was in like a dining room or something and when he got up he was actually out of the frame and that just didn't sort of go I don't think it and it was it quite rainy the image, I don't know if it was done at night time. as in it as you are in natural because it cuts off his head whereas you feel more in it when you can see his whole yeah. body. Um, anything else at all that you would think that we can work on or are you happy? Mm -hmm. I think that's a good for me. Yeah. 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 Yeah.